Small cars are a lot safer than they were just a few years ago, but that doesn't mean they offer the same level of protection as larger ones. To see how the laws of physics affect their protection in a crash, we recently conducted a series of tests crashing mini cars and a micro car into mid-sized cars from the same manufacturer. Crash test results tell you a lot about the differences in vehicle performance within a size class, but you can't compare a small car with a good rating to a larger car with the same rating. That's because size and weight are important in how the crash turns out. Vehicle size protects occupants in crashes because bigger vehicles usually have longer front ends with longer crush zones. The longer the crush zone, the longer the vehicle crushes, and the lower the forces on the occupants inside. We chose these cars for our new crash test because Honda, Toyota, and Daimler, which makes Mercedes and smart cars, all have mini cars or micro cars with good crashworthiness ratings. However, crash test ratings aren't the whole story. All other things being equal, people in larger, heavier cars will fare better in their crashes than people in smaller, lighter cars. In a crash between a small, lightweight car and a heavier one, the smaller car is driven backwards. That means higher forces on the occupants of the smaller car and lower ones on the occupants of the bigger one. The Toyota Yaris gets a good rating in our frontal offset test. In a head-on crash with another mini car at these speeds, it would do well. But as you can see, against the larger and heavier Camry, the occupant compartment basically collapsed. We have buckles in the roof here and here, and the door sill is bent toward the ground. In a real-world crash like this, the driver of the Yaris would sustain serious injuries. By comparison, the driver of the Camry would fare much better. The results of these tests don't mean that we can't have good fuel economy and safety. Cars like this Ford Fusion Hybrid and the Toyota Camry Hybrid are larger and heavier than mini cars and micro cars, but they get the same or better fuel economy, although all cars have gotten much safer in recent years. You can't repeal the laws of physics. Large, heavier cars still provide better occupant protection in a crash than smaller, lighter ones.